What's up, everybody? Hope you're having a fantastic day. Today is seeing if we can get out of Mount Moon. Part 2, such a long episode in the beginning. I did not want to bore you guys with the full length. So I went ahead and cut up into two sections. Part 1 will be linked down below. This is Part 2. If you haven't seen Part 1 first, go watch it. So you know what's going on, so you're not totally lost in the dark. Without further ado, let's get into it. So we're still trying to escape Mount Moon. And usually in the original Fire Red um, and Leaf Green, in here you would get a fossil. One or two fossils. I do not know what is replacing the fossil we'll find out when we get there i'm still just running away from battles trying to get out of here as quickly as possible like i'm trying to sneak past this guy over wine counter just trying to sneak past like oh, nep is like oh you want to fight me again I'm like no i've already caught you i've already defeated you I defeat you in a gym. I don't want to take you on again. And of course, he sees me. I'm like, I'm gonna see if I some. And he's around all of a second. I'm like, God darn it. Why must you do that? Well, I mean, at least we could just see one person who is part technically of the, say, evil team, because this is where Team Rocket Leader was to be. So you can kind of see and guess who's gonna be replacing Team Rocket in, th in this game. Sends out a lonely Cyberman. Ooh, so close to be taking out Cyberman in a single kick. Oh, it just oh, he's actually faster and get the acid off. Glad we ended up just kicking him in the head and he is gone. Like I'm just happy that. The acid did not cause poison because I am pretty sure I do not have any antidotes. And I don't know if um, poison will kill you in this game. Well, let's not find out. I sent out another Cyberman. Let's go kick him. Half health again. Lear lowers the attack of my Piccolo. But it's not going to be enough. We're going to use kick again. He did not go for acid this time. And oh, he barely lives and goes for acid. I just got here, we're just like, we'll just punch him in the face. Get him over with. One quick jab to the face, he'd be gone. So we defeated the, the grunt. I'm still doing the switch training of when, it, when a fighter gets to a certain level, switch him out for the next one, switch him out for the next one, and so on, so on. Now, if you watched when I took on the first gym, I was surprised at what happened. If you don't know what happened, go back and watch it. Um, and I'm gonna, if you've seen it, you'll know what I'm talking about. I'm kinda gonna see if I can't do something for the second the second gym because if it's going if it's like going based off of the story then I kind of get I kind of know what's going to happen next if you watch Dragon Ball Z you'll know what uh what area slash fighters the next gym will have so after this I'm going to train up a certain fighter and we're gonna see if we can't do a repeat of the first gym, but with the second fighter onto the second gym. I think that I think that'd make for a funny part. Just imagine <laughs> what if in Dragon Ball Z team training, I arrange it so the Z fighters are able to make up for what they for what they couldn't do. In Dragon Ball Z. Oh, 
So we come across our second grunt. Now, I, like, I wonder if we're just going to come across that guy as the grunt for all of them, or are they gonna are they gonna switch? Just trying to know, because Team Rocket had like different sprites for the different you know the different characters. It's like I'm wondering. Uh, like if we get following fire red leaf green if we get to a certain part and it's a, it is all up with the the bad guys like I wonder if it's gonna be all one sprite or it's gonna be switched between the three sprites so here my plan got foiled Piccolo bit the dust. <laughs> I just hope Piccolo bit the dust. If we come across the Dragon Ball, hopefully it's not turned to stone. So, no, I'm like, you know what? No. Worry, we're in this. I'm just gonna take him out. So, we use Masenko. Ooh, a little bit over half. Half, half. I cannot talk today. So we use another Masenko. Still not gone. Still a kill him. To use Blade. So I'm just use. I know I'm saying, I'm like, just get out of here. Just get out of here, you're done. Oh, okay, and I'm like, now nah, you want to get a critical hit? Really? On the little itty bitty sliver HP, you couldn't have got a critical hit on the first hit or the second hit. No, just my luck. Can I get a critical hit on the last one? Little sliver HP. Oh. Okay, so they they are they are in here, and does that mean I have to go hunt for all of them? What happens when we get all of them? I'm just like, I'm just like, this one. I'm just like, I'm gonna split, put Gohan in the front because everybody's weak. And like, this is pretty much, I believe this is pretty much the last guy you fight before uh, exiting. So I'm like, you know what? Let's go into Gohan. Let's go into our start. Piccolo. Come on, Gohan. Let's show Piccolo what we learned. He's Misenko. Okay. More than... More than half. He's used giant form. He's going to up his attack and defense. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you. Just another Masenko. Right to the leg. Ooh. So another Masenko. Should do it. Oh no, we go for a punch. The punch does it anyway. The punch does it anyway. We reach level 15. And we learn the... The Kamehameha! Nice! Very nice. Let's test this out and see how it and see how it works. On Turtles. The fire move. Not bad, not bad. Not bad, that means another one should take him out. And it does. It does. 
the 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 animations are like compared to our other moves, the animation is a little lengthy. Cause like he does it, it shows it hitting him, and then like it leaves Gohan's hands and it goes to the enemy. Compared to other moves, it's kind of, you know, it's kind of lengthy. It, takes, it has the most frames. Not bad on on this guy. This was like the decent amount. This one's doing a decent amount of damage. I might see if I can't find. Um, I forget what it's called, but it boosts the num. It boosts the original number of the times you can use a move. So instead of twenty, I can get up to basically twenty-five. Unless I find something that's a better move for him. We got this three-star Dragon Ball. Let's go. Now I kind of want to see like where the rest of them are. Cool, I wonder if we collect one. Can we, do we get a wish? Is it one wish and then the ball scatter? Or is it like... Oh, you can't, nah, you, you wish you can't use it for 12 hours. Well, as I find out, I have to collect them all. And summon Shinra and make a wish. At this point, it's like, <laughs> let's go. Let's get out of here. I can't want to, I got the Dragon Ball. I just want to get, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to come back later. Get everything that I missed. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, subscribe.